it's burp time! Uh. And now to the first lift, which is an old single speed lift which has been horribly modernised by Stunner. It now has Leicester controls and spends ages levelling so it now goes slower than what it did originally. What a stupid mod. Now, let's go out onto the roof. Then let's surf the lift. Oh, there we go. Now along to the next building. And of course, let's surf the lift. Now, let me go to this really awesome old building. I'm not sure if it's from the 30s or from the 50s, but it's really awesome and has the original lifts. Yes! Which are some really awesome old Keith lifts. There's actually six lifts here. And these lifts are grouped into three lots of two lifts. And each one of these group of two lifts has a passenger lift and a service lift. The passenger lifts still have their original logic and are really awesome. Although the cab is slightly modernised, but only slightly. The goods lift looks really awesome. But sadly, the logic's been replaced with stupid variable frequency. Let's first go into the passenger lift. And now let's surf it. Now let me go into the goods lift. Now, let's surf it.
then let's go out onto the roof. And a lot into the motor room. Now, let me go to the next building, which has a Schindler 3300. <laughs> what logic cabinet is this? <laughs> and now it's smoke machine time! Well, it had to pump all of the liquid in. I'm just going to put that back in so I can pack it up quickly. Wait, that is, that's water vapour, right? Nope, it's propane glycol, a couple of other chemicals. And now let's free fall the lift. Oh, there we go. And along we go to another Schindler 3300, but this one's a bit faster. This one goes 1.6 meters a second. And now, let me go to the next building and into the lift, which has been horribly modernised by Paul and Dan Woody. It's got faulty. And let's go up on to the roof. And into the motor room. Still going. We can. And now let's free fall the lift. And now let me go to a nice first generation eco disc which has been modernised. Seriously, 
some stupid little genetic company actually went and modernised an eco disc. This is ridiculous. They've actually replaced the eco disc motor with a Xyl Zeta lift motor. I just do not get that. Eco disc just runs so well. There's, there's nothing wrong with the eco disc motor. Even if they want to modernise the cab or so, even that doesn't really need modernising. But to replace the eco disc motor with a Zeta lift motor, it's just so stupid, unnecessary. The stupid genetic company that did this are just complete idiots. You are not authorised to use this floor. You are not. You are not authorised to use this floor. You are not authorised to use this floor. Doors closing. Please mind the doors. Fifth floor. Doors opening. You are not authorised to use this floor. And now, let we go to the Broadwater Farm Estate, but sadly, the lifts have been horribly modernised. And now, let me go into a little first of the state, but sadly the lift has been horribly modernised. This lift's actually really small. Time. 